Welcome back, everyone. Our next guests, ooh, do I love them. They recently shared their talents in front of thousands for the annual tree lighting in Washington, D.C. Needless to say, they're going to get you in the holiday spirit. We're so happy to have Joe Cranston and John Driscoll Hopkins back in our spotlight. I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus underneath the mistletoe last night. She didn't see me creep down the stairs to have a peek. She thought that I was upstairs in my bedroom fast asleep. Then I saw mommy tickle Santa Claus underneath his beard so snowy white. Oh, what a laugh it would have been if daddy had only seen mommy kissing Santa Claus last night. Johnny, how you doing, man? Hey, Joe Granston, what's Good up, buddy? Merry Good Christmas, to see you. Brother. Merry Christmas. You sound hey. wonderful. Thank you. I have a quick question for you. Yeah. Did you really see your mom kissing Santa Claus? Yeah, I did. It was weird. Man, I can't figure this out because uh, I saw my mom kissing Santa Claus. Right. Oh, wait. What? Yeah. <laughs> What? She was kissing Santa Claus, man. Does he kiss all the mommies? I think he does. Check no, it out. Here we go. I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus underneath that mistletoe last night. She didn't see me creep down those stairs just to have a peek. She thought that I was upstairs in my bedroom fast asleep. And then I, I saw mommy tickle Santa Claus underneath his beard so snowy white. Well, what a laugh it would have been if daddy had only seen mommy kissing Santa Claus last night. Come on, Johnny. Yes, sir. Santa Claus underneath the mistletoe last night. Hey, you know, Johnny, she didn't see us creep down those stairs just to have a pee. I know, right? She thought that we were tucked up in our bedrooms fast asleep. <laughs> then we saw Mommy tickle Santa Claus underneath his beard so snowy white. Kissing Santa Claus, Mommy me kissing night. Santa Claus, kissing Santa Claus last night. We love you, Mommy. Love you, Mommy. Ah, yes, you guys are awesome. Thank you. Welcome Thank back. You. I do have to break it to you. How are you? I was kissing Santa too. Oh, it? goodness. Yeah, it wasn't just your mom's. Yeah. I'm sorry. All right, I'm so excited for you. Your new album, you better watch out. Yep. Tell me more about it. Well, we, we uh, just at the very end of last year, we finished it and we've been pushing it all year this year. So uh, we're excited to be sharing that with everyone. And uh, that record uh, features me as the, the leader of the vocal thing. And then Joe did one just 
uh, right on the, the heels of that, that that he's featured with his entire band again. So there's two of them you can get. Awesome. Um, this is the one we performed from, and, uh, and that song is on you better watch out. I love it. And I'm so excited. I was looking at pictures. So proud of you, too. Oh. You experienced something uh, pretty incredible. You actually got to perform at the National Tree Lighting Ceremony in Washington. How Absolutely. was that? Yeah, you know. Um, Look, there you are. Oh, my God. Hey, this is, thank this you, sir. This is surreal. <laughs> I mean, I know you two are used to performing, but come on. Well, it's, it's a big deal, no matter no matter where, where you stand politically, to, to be able to to stand there and it, it, you know in front of this iconic stage and, and be a part of oh. you know this this uh, historic event. So yes. I'm very proud to have been a part. That of was it. very well said. It didn't matter. Just having that experience, truly unforgettable. Right yeah, it was, it was amazing. I, I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe how much security was there. That was cool. <laughs> I bet. But, yes. But I, I, I feel the same way John feels. I was uh, I was nervous at first about what would come on Facebook and the comments and the different comments. Everybody's been supportive. Of course. And and, it, and you know it's what an honor to be at the White House and play for uh, our country. You know? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And I can't help but notice you had uh, some dance. I didn't <laughs> yeah. know you two dance. <laughs> the stars right here. Yeah. Uh, dance lessons, be honest. I'll tell you what, man, that was I was so scared. We oh, had about <laughs> what's oh that's the rehearsal. Yeah. Man. Oh that's great. We were about seven days out till we had to go to Washington and John had an idea. He said we, we gotta do something during the break. Why don't we get a little dance together, get it choreographed? Yeah. So I love him. it. I tried it. He's the dancer. I, I'm sure I almost fell down just now. You no, saw you it. did not. You two are smooth <laughs> as silk. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, next performance wanna get everybody really excited about the Atlanta Pops, right? Yes. There, yes, there are two of them we need to mention. Um, I've got a show on the 15th at the Old Town Athletic Club. Um, coming up really quick. If you haven't got a ticket, you probably can still get one or, or maybe the brunch. Um, and then on the 18th, we're playing together at uh, Sylvia Beard. Yeah, with my um, whole big band, John Driscoll Hopkins. And, nice. Uh, and, uh, we're very excited about that. It's a beautiful theater in, in Buford. So, yeah. We are so excited that you guys took time out of your very busy schedules to come back and see us and get us in the holiday spirit. We love you guys. Always a pleasure. Thank you, Thank you so, so much. We appreciate it. And don't you go anywhere. More Atlanta and Company after this short break. Show me those moves. And we're matching. Thank <laughs> you. 